I'm so disappointed. Yum, great. Watch out, it's just been dripping a little bit. Are you having a banana? Oh, that's a good idea. Is not right. Very. Aren't bananas weird when they're not right? It's like such a strange. I'm so. Taste. I'm so disappointed. That's perfect. What are you talking about? What? Who tastes it when I'm tasting? It just doesn't taste very nice. Ew. Why does it taste like that? Maybe it's just morning. <laughs> Maybe this. Oh, that's better. A nice palate cleanser of pre-workout. Yeah. What's up, guys? I'm doing a montage oh. this morning. <laughs> That's too much energy for before Hey, I'm am. trying to wake everyone up. Yes, look at this beautiful view. What a glorious day. Oh, <gasps> Oh, he's got peanut butter. <laughs> Look at his crinkly ears. Hello. Maybe we need to bring Simi. Yeah, yeah, but it's still yeah. like lots of cardio. So fun. So much fun. <laughs> Did you do this one? Yeah. So yeah. Drowning in the lost emotion. Crying like some kind of ocean from my eyes. But I got a bottle of the whole. Good morning guys, welcome to the first daily vlog in the new house. I'm very excited to be filming and taking you guys along today. What do we think about these filming locations? Like obviously our freaking front door is open, what do we think? The good thing about this house is that it's kind of good lighting everywhere. So I love that. So tonight I've actually got an event with Lash Therapy, which is exciting. You guys know I love my lash serums. So I thought I'd quickly open it because this is probably all for the event tonight, which is so cute. But we've been to the gym this morning. It was cardio, so we were just so, so sweaty. Yeah, ended up having to wash my hair. Oh, this is so fun. Okay, what is this? Growth Serum Mascara. Eyebrow Gel. Growth Serum Infused Eyebrow Gel. That is going to be amazing. Maybe I'll pop that on this morning. And then the Lash Growth Serum. I've bought one of these before. The like comb lash curl is from Lash Therapy. And I really like them. I use mine every day, so it's nice to have another one. Tonight, the event is a boat party, which is so much fun. I'm really excited to go. And it's like all pink themed. So I've got this really fun pink top that's like literally a feather boa. I was gonna wear it to Harry Styles, but I'm definitely gonna wear it tonight instead. <gasps> you can measure your eyelashes. That would be so good to see how long they get. What a great idea. Um, but I'm just going to have some breakfast and then probably blow dry my hair and get started on the day. And you guys can follow me around, hang out with me where we're, we're doing a bit of work from home. Okay, so I've just been sitting here doing a bunch of, oh my gosh, wait, I don't even think I've shown you my new desk. <gasps> Look at this. I just bought this on the weekend. It is literally a two meter long desk and amazing for this space. Obviously, this is still kind of like a bomb site, but like this sort of work area is amazing so far. It fits two people. So on the days that Mel is working, she can have one side of the desk doing your orders. And then I have this side doing admin or computer work and it works so well. I've just had to do some work for the Clayco and I'm also dropping this load back at the kiln this afternoon. So I thought I'd quickly glaze these pieces, but I thought I'd try something different today. And what I've done is dripped 
our beautiful glazes. This is the white and speckle. It's going to be white and speckle off the side. And I think these will look so cute when they are finished. Like you can see the outline looks really beautiful. Hopefully they turn out as good as they look now. I've had the courier come. He's grabbed all the orders, which is super helpful because yesterday was a public holiday. So they couldn't come. So we had a few that needed to go out. I also am not sure if the event is gonna go ahead tonight because it is on a boat and this is the weather. I don't know if you can see, but it is raining so much today and it's a four hour like boat party. So we're not sure if it's still on slash if we'll be going just because it is quite risky. I've got a few things to shoot today. Um, a couple of brands that I'm working with just need some extra bits of content. So I'm going to make those for them. Overall today is just really fun. Like I love days like this and I'm so grateful to be able to do this from home. After lunch, I might head out because I obviously want to drop these back at Kiln, but I also want to go and buy a birthday prezi for Vonnie. And I think I want to buy a beautiful gift from the Flower Posse, who does these beautiful flower arrangements in the Shire. Her name's Bronte. She's amazing. But she also has, like, this storefront in Karangbar. And she has, like, a bunch of products and vases. And I think it could just make, like, the perfect little gift box with a bunch of those and maybe some flowers too. So that'll be really cute. Hopefully I can sort that out. I just love, like, homewares -y sort of gifts. And I feel like Von will really like that too. Let's go and have some lunch. Jordi cooked up this amazing dinner last night. Um, we're still doing the every plate thing and this one was like a 10 out of 10. I love that there are always so many leftovers. It is so good. What we like to do is if it's a recipe that we can kind of bulk ourselves, whether it's like we use extra basmati rice, we put extra pasta in, or we use like a can of coconut cream that's a bit bigger instead of like the smaller ones. I highly recommend just having like extra pantry staples to really like bulk up your meals and then you get them for lunch the next day too. We do this for almost every meal and it only costs us like a dollar or two extra just to like have the staples. But this was this veggie pasta with like a coconutty sort of base, coconut tomato base. Ah. <gasps> So good, and Jordi roasted the vegetables, so it's just so good. I love days like this where I don't have to do any cooking for lunch. Obviously, that's a perk of like working from home is that I can cook something up, but most of the time I don't want to. I want to have a beautiful meal left over or ready for me. I'm just so sad about this weather. Like I would have loved to sit outside in beautiful sunshine today, but unfortunately our outdoor couch is completely soaked. And it's got snails all over it because they love the rain, Simmy. Simba has been hanging out in his new backyard. Have you been playing in the rain? Can I just like take a moment for this beautiful house? Like I cannot actually believe that we live here. Like look at this jungle. It still feels like we're in like an Airbnb or resort. Like you're actually kidding. This looks like a rainforest retreat but it is seriously such an upgrade from our last place. Obviously we loved our last place, but it just like reeked of mold. And as you guys know, we had our walls removed. So it was just disgusting. If I'm completely honest, like it was actually disgusting. They're doing like the final inspection of that one today. Um, and I was like handing the keys back being like, I'm so sorry. Like the place still does not have walls. It's kind of like not my problem because the tradies never fixed it. <gasps> Yum. Oh my God. Why is it so much better the next day as well? All the flavors have like marinated. Why was this bag of palms and cheese so small? Oh, 125 grams. Why was it so expensive? So, is that your friends? Oh, hello friends. Give me a high five. Oh, thank you. That's very nice. You're so cute. Look how golden he's getting. You used to be completely white. I cannot believe we got such a surprise. We got such a surprise. Oh, this is his favorite thing to do at the moment. <laughs> Show us your bum. Show me your bum. <laughs> oh, yummy toe beans. Stop showing everyone your bottom. Stop showing that you're exposing yourself. Indecency. 
I've just gotten back from shopping and I thought I'd show you what I bought for Vaughn. As I said, I went to my friend's flower shop called the Flower Posse. If you want to check it out, it's beautiful. I bought her this bouquet with, it's actually got a reusable vase under there, which is so cute. And I also picked a few things from the shop, which they did gift wrap, which is so cute, but I'm going to undo it because I think I want to pop some ceramics in there for her that I've made. Okay, I got her this beautiful beach towel. It is massive, I won't open it, but it's like gingham sort of print and then it's got tassels. It feels amazing. I'm so excited for her to have that. And then I also got her this beautiful fig room spray. It's just amazing, like I smelled that and I was like, oh my gosh, she will be obsessed. Good morning guys, it is Saturday. I'm having a delicious, nutritious Nutri-Grain for breakfast. This morning, Geordie's actually organized a whole photo shoot for, I guess the family, because Simba's coming as well. But he's been running around all morning trying to get a haircut and nowhere has had like availability or they've been closed. So it's been a little stressful. So we just did a DIY home haircut just then. Look, I air wrapped my hair but it just like falls out immediately, which is so sad. But this is the first outfit that I'm gonna wear. We were going for like a fully neutrals and white sort of dress code is what they said. So that's what we're going for. I don't know much about like where we're going, but I think it's like a studio to do the photos, which will be fun. These are Simi's outfits for the shoot. They're from the Better Boutique. If anyone wants to get them. But we're gonna be matching with mummy. This one, so cute. You can look so handsome, Bob. And then this one, see me. I thought I'd bring you guys along and we can get some BTS of the shoot. Mm mm mm. Tina, we're here for your photo shoot. This is Geordie's first photo shoot in a long few time. years. How are you feeling? It feels more professional than the last one I did as well. And we've got Simi this time. Now so. we've got a baby. And do I need a step over here? This way. This is Geordie's second outfit. It's gorgeous. Keep the buttons as is? Yeah, I think so. Outfit number two. Never make it out. I'm a five star brain in a two star town. And I'ma give it back when I have enough money in my hands. Enough for the friends and the fam. And I owe it all to y'all.